I'm David from Trade Nation, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to view your transaction history. Okay, so I've got the trading platform up and running in front of me, and down at the bottom, we have the usual tabs that you can see open positions, opening orders, and then next one along, transaction history. So let's just click on there. And this brings up a load of information. What this is showing us is all the details from the trades that I have opened and closed. So this is completed trades. In other words, anything to do with what I've got open at the moment isn't going to come up and show up in this tab. But you can see from here, uh, it tells me that I opened uh, a trade on a certain date when I and uh, the time that I opened it, the closing date, the closing time, the market. And then it tells you whether the trade receivable or trade payable. What this is telling me is, was that a profitable trade or did it result in a loss? And if you can uh, go along here, you can see the amount that I traded, the opening price, the closing price, the profit and loss. So trade receivable, that was a profit to me. That also means that I have my balance updated and it gives me the reference number of that particular trade. Now, there's also a lot of other information that you can find out from your tra transaction history. For instance, it'll show you any if you've withdrawn any money and it'll show you if you've deposited any money. And it'll also show you any overnight funding charges that there might be. If you look right down at the bottom of my transaction history, you'll see there I held a position open over the weekend and it cost me 41 cents. Now, this is just one day's worth of history. If you go and click on the view box, you can see that you can go back further. You can go back three days, five days or all time. So click on five days and you can see that there's a lot more information down there. It even shows you the deposit going into the account. Now, all transactions, if you click on this button, it will take out and identify individual trades, but also specifically deposits and withdrawal. So you can look at those things, uh, separate those out from all the other noise that's going on around. And finally, if you want to download this information into an Excel spreadsheet, all you have to do is click on the button download as CSV here. OK, so that's a quick tour around the transaction history tab. I hope you found that of interest. And don't forget to keep in touch with everything that's going on with us at Trade Nation. Please go to our YouTube channel and click on the subscribe button. So all I can say now is thank you very much for watching and good luck with your trading in the future.